about Philly 20 fam. It's your girl knitting that and I'm back home. We got What's up, Philly Funny Family? What's up, bro? Why, bro? Why, bro? Why? Hey, and then we got Lil Dino. What's up, Lil Dino? Your eyes? Corrine? Some of your eyes, buddy. Hey, say hey. What's up, Lil? Hey, Lil. Hey, Lana. Hey, Lana. Hey, Lana. Oh, that's Lana. Slay Lana. Slay Lana. In a minute. Okay, see, here we go, here we go. We've only been here for a few minutes, but we're ready to go. No. She did? Oh, I forgot. So, again, we are just chilling, relaxing, maxing. You tired already? Good thing he has the rest of the day, so we might take a little break because yes, this stuff is very hot. And um then we'll be back with you guys, I guess, right? We'll get a little bit of the room and the scenery when we get back upstairs, mm -hmm. of course. But until we see y'all again. Hey Pam, it's y'all girl. Uh -oh, I'm gonna... I am going to do the uh, cold water challenge for y'all in a minute. I'm going to have to handle it. I'm going to see if we can get it from the jacuzzi. Like 100 and something degrees over to I told him you won't record me do the cold water, jump into the cold water and pretend to I'm gonna try. What is it? Go ahead. Then you're gonna get on the other side of here. Can we do it for two? I'm definitely putting that up. I'm definitely putting that up. I'm definitely putting that up. She definitely took one for the team, y'all. I'm definitely put that up. Yo, you got the video you wanted today. She got the video she wanted today, you two. Trust and believe that. <laughs> How does it feel? How does it feel? Let me zoom in there. How does it feel? She bust that royal. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. I'm opening that tonight. <laughs> Yeah.
Dino, you get them hot ones? Dino, you putting that work in, Dino? Dino, you putting that work in? You gotta get your stuff out. You putting that work in on that sandwich, bro? That's what I'm talking about. Here, you don't need to put my foot back. Yes, because you're not walking downstairs with all that water no. on the floor. Okay. Yeah, I feel bad. Coming out the pool. What's up, Philly Sony fam? It's your girl Nettie Net, and I'm back. <sighs> Today is May 20th. Ten years ago. A couple hours later. I was uh Getting bad headaches. Weren't as bad as I said they were, but I should have been honest. But when I went to the hospital, my blood sugar was up. And they were like, we got to take this baby. And I knew I was a month early, so I didn't know what was going to happen. Because they said, your baby is only two pounds. So, I kind of knew he was going to end up in the NICU. Hurt feeling. Needless to say... They held me in the bed for a couple hours. As my blood sugar went up, they decided it's time to take the baby. So I got rushed into an emergency C-section. They tried to give me an epidural, things didn't go right. So all I remember is them saying, knock her out. We have to get the baby out. So I was knocked out, maybe about two hours later, I woke up and I'm like, where's my child? And they're like, oh, well, we had to take him to the NICU, which I should have known. But my son needed surgery. Um, they said about three or four months they would start surgery. A um, couple days later, actually it took about four days before I got to see my baby. So uh, when I finally got to see him, mother's check. So I went to check him and I seen he had a hernia. So that's kind of why they didn't know if he was boy or girl. Because of first the hypospadias and then the hernia was down there. That meant that he had a hole below his belly button into his stomach, in his stomach. And it made his intestines drop down into his urethral area. So they let me know that, you know, you could always push the intestines back up because they're almost like, like spaghetti strings. I would, that's the best way for me to explain it. But, you know, I would kind of push it back up into the hole. But when he would breathe out or something, it would pop back down. So it was very scary because they couldn't do surgery until he was about three months old. Mind you, he had to stay in the hospital for a month. So when he was released from the hospital, I knew he had about two more months before he can go in for surgery. Therefore, I had to be extremely careful. I had this four pound baby boy who was not two pounds, but four. Um, when he came home, he was about five pounds, a month old and a cry baby. He cried four hours straight at times and cried and cried and cried. All I remember is crying. So, um, needless to say, three months went by. I didn't let anyone watch him, take care of him, do anything with or for him, except for mommy and daddy, because we knew how to take care of him as far as this hernia until he was born. And, give me a second. So, until he was born, then we decided to have surgery at three months. Um, back on this story again later but I want to show y'all you know we came to a hotel and that was the whole point of my story but uh Mary I has came up over the years you know um I used to stay here back in the day and it wasn't nothing to brag about so I stayed last night and I stayed with the kids so ain't nothing to brag about again but it was very beautiful nice day slept good um but I never got a room tour so I'm gonna just show y'all a quick view of what we spent time doing just relaxing did the pool as he wanted to you know this ain't nothing major but the shower you know the only thing i like about these um marriott came up they used to have little bottles of shampoo and conditioner but now they got their own little pumps you can wash your hair as many times as you want 
You don't have to use that little bottle. So, um, I just wanted to give you a little tour of where we're at. So here's our room, of course. You know, nothing spiffed up about it because we had kids all night, like I said. So do y'all expect it to be uh, not juice and party friendly? So we had a pizza party. We had hoogies. We did it big. Sorry, Dean. The kids are in the pool for now. We're about to check out soon. They're getting our last bit of this fun. Is stuff, this is the stuff I'm taking out. I'm going to take it to the car. Okay. You know, I'm on my way. Shoes, so you want to take the shoes to him? Yeah. Isn't there another pair of Crocs up here somewhere? I think so. I hope it's not over there in that corner under those blankets. I got to check. He bought another pair of Crocs up here. Remember, Dean had yours on and then you grabbed the other I sandals? Have my Crocs on. I have these on. No, there was another pair of Crocs. Okay. I don't think so. I think so. Here's just a quick view. Ours? Okay. So. They can. I thought that it was 12 o'clock. Just wanted to give you all a pretty quick view of where we stayed for the night. And it looks like it's checkout time. So we're about to go. And um, get with you guys later, okay? kids just tripped over something that's properly not secured here at this hotel so I'm guessing it goes on like this me being a maintenance man that's how it goes if they have people to come and check on the pool stuff like this wouldn't happen my wife wouldn't have fell in the pool yesterday
So this is the menu screen, you pull it up, and as you can see, it has every different setting in there, and um, you have the weather section. Okay, it'll bring up your current weather at the time for each day. Okay, go back into the menu settings again. It'll bring up the social media. Okay, well, this one isn't going off, because you know we can't do Instagram here. Um, you have the local favorites. That's your local area, anything within a mile area of the area. So you see in here, they have a pizza, California Pizza Kitchen. You can actually tap into it. It'll give you the actual directions and the settings. So as you can see, this board here is a very good addition to this hotel. Um, it's very useful for when you're in the different areas. You have the attractions areas, which you can go in there and tell you schools, universities, Washington Valley, zoos, farms, and different other things. You have the retail shopping areas. They can tell you what's within the one to 10 to 20 miles radius on, on, the, whole, on the whole app. So as you can see, there's the actual settings of everything that's in there. Traffic, food, beverage, sports, flights, hotels. Let's look at the flights and see what we got here on the flight side. Okay, so as we go into the flight, now you can see different settings. So of American Airlines, um, you have Delta, you have British Airways, and I'm pretty sure you can go into the menu section to pull up more. And as you can see, it does change. The delayed maps, they have a delayed map, okay? So it will show you flight delays, what is actually up and running at the time. And basically, that's what you have here at this, at this establishment. So as you guys can see, it's built into the wall in the court Marriott. And this is your boy, the DAN316. And I just wanted to bring you this tech review and the skill review on how to basically use this um, what it does and basically what they have installed here in 2018 for you know their customers and their guests here so there you have it thanks for letting me share once again this is your boy DAN316 Philly's funny family Nettie and Little Dinos and that's a YouTube stream so jump on in you know always at your tech review stuff thanks for letting me share